Hello guys, I'm going on the top 10's list. And yeah, they will be going over really bad tour lists. Or lists that don't seem anything good. And yeah, I'll be going over the list of the worst games. We'll not be reviewing going through this list again. The newest game on the list is Bubsy Powers and Fire. Whereas of course the whole Bubsy series sucks anyways. So it's deserving to be on the list. So yeah, we'll be going over the remixes of the top 10s. And yeah, there's a lot of these lists to go over. Most of these actually look good. Actual bad games such as Superman 64, Animal Crossing, Amiibo Festival, Desert Bus. And then we have this list. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare is apparently worse than the E.T. game. Yes, this list. This is the guy who also called me a mom. Oh, I, I, I meant to go on the list. We'll be going over this. Yeah. It is a <laughs> remix of the worst games of all time. And yeah, we'll be going over this list. So Call of Duty Infinite Warfare is apparently worse than... Yeah, that, that one is definitely... Definitely, definitely worthy of being on the worst games of all time list. But if you go far down, you uh, you won't understand the list at all. So some of these games are pretty bad. And then he says Fortnite's a good game. Fortnite. Fucking Fortnite. And then we have Destiny 2 being worse than Action 52, which is 52 garbage games. I haven't played... Destiny was a very disappointing game. But yeah, it's completely worse than Action 52. Then we have Sticker Star Wars. Of course, that's good. That is the zone on any worst games list. Paper Mario Sticker Star is a disgrace. A disgrace to Paper Mario. It ruined Paper Mario. It, ru it ruined Paper Mario just as badly as Fallout 36 ruined Fallout. This game is a disgrace. It's burned in hell. Paper Mario Sticker Star is a disgrace. And yeah, I think everybody should think that too. And then we have Overwatch apparently being worse than the CDI games. But we have worse lists to go. This is actually not a bad list compared to the troll lists. We're going to go further down on the list. So yeah, we'll be going over more terrible lists. So the first few lists are actually pretty decent. And we have Minecraft apparently is the worst game according to Koopanator. Yes, Minecraft is the worst game. This is just why. There's no comment. Oh, Minecraft's the worst game apparently because of reasons. <clears throat> of course, my opinions of worst games are very right here. And then we have Final Fantasy XIV, which is apparently one of the worst games of all time. I haven't played it, so I can't really tell you about it. And then FNAF. Oh, yeah, that's deserving. That's not even a game. You know, the so-called indie, ho indie horror breakouts, as I call them, are terrible games. Terrible games. And yeah, if you look at Doki Doki Weird to Club, that game is deserving beyond the list of the worst games of all time. Doki Doki Weird to Club is garbage. Fappy Bird, yeah. We get, we, I tell you about games like Mario, games that actually are good. And then we have this list. Mario is among one of the worst games of all time. Yes, Mario is among the worst games of all time. Oh, then we have Mario is among the worst games of all time. Yes. Yes. It was the, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because that's the real Mario Bros. 2. Not that Mario Bros. Not, yeah. And then we have this game. Yeah, this game is dessert. I hate this game too. New Super Mario Bros. 2 was an extreme disappointment. I don't think it's among the worst games. But it's among the most disappointing games of all time. Donkey Kong? One of the worst games of all time? You are stupid. You are stupid. Doki Doki Wizard Club. Yes, I can definitely agree on that one. You know, Doki Doki Wizard Club is one of the most overrated piles of crap. Ever in gaming history. I always stand by that. Even though. Oh by far you ended Troy. No. I don't like Doki Doki Weirds Club. I do not like the game. Okay. I have an opinion does not make you a troll. Okay. Doki Doki Weirds Club is garbage. It is not even a game. There's no gameplay. It's basically just cutscenes. Okay. It's basically just a movie. They just press A over and over and over again. You have like a few choices. Like every Telltale game ever made. And yeah, Doki Doki Wizard Club barely counts as a game. As much as much of a game as Baldi's Basics and FNAF is as a game. And we go on further down those more bad lists. And we have this list. Oh yes. This list of the worst games. Halo. Yes. Apparently one of the greatest FPS games of all time is one of the worst. Why? Because he sucks at the game? Wow. 
What well, what about the campaign? You you, you only you, you don't play you play Halo for the campaign, not the multiplayer, okay? Call of Duty and you know certain other games they play for the can the multiplayer. Halo is a game, yeah. The multiplayer is great, but the campaign is the best part of the game. My Yeah, you hate games because you suck at you shouldn't play games anyways. If you if you hate game because you suck at a game, you shouldn't play a game. It's just that simple. But you hate Mega Man for being, for you sucking at Mega Man. Well, I do hate Mega Man. I hate the whole franchise. Mega Man is basically the Call of Duty of the 90s. Except it's overpraised. Need any more explanation about that? Do we have this? Oh, yeah, this is a very completely rational list here. Agree. Baldi's Basics does suck. I actually played Baldi's Basics and it's a pile of garbage. The next game's list is... Minecraft apparently is the worst game. Another list of Minecraft being the worst games. Then we have this one. This list. Oh, yes. This list. The worst games of all time. <laughs> Sonic and Knuckles is not... Is, is that actually a pretty great game? It's not terrible. The, the classic Sonic games are great. They're, they're amazing games. And, you know, this guy is just... Ugh, dumb. And we have some random. Oh, really? Wow. Wow, you hate the game. You, it's another person who hates games because they suck at games. And yes, I do not like the Mega Man franchise. The Mega Man franchise is basically. It, ha it sucks because of bad controls. Mega Man sucks because of the very, very, very bad and awful controls. And yeah. And yeah. But we haven't reached any of the bad swoists. Yes, the bad and swoists. Oh yes, this is one. This guy. I don't like Mega Man 2, but yeah, this is a swoist here. He just put a bunch of popular games on here to piss people off. And yeah, he says that Pac-Man tw <laughs> Tally 2600 is not a bad game. Well, it is when a lot of people can't play the game. The game sucks. The game is so bad that you don't even want to play the game. So now I'll be going further down on the list of bad lists of the worst games of all time. And now we have another troll list. Two spots down. Yes, this is apparently a list on wine. The only two port choices that can free choices that can agree with is Sonic Boom, Rise of Lyric, Fallout 76, and Fortnite Battle Royale. But really, you're really thinking that I don't like Mario Galaxy, and that's because of its bad controls, because of the Wii, because I hate the Wii as a console, but I can still agree that it's still a good game compared to Fortnite, because Fortnite is garbage. And what the hell is Persona 5 and Smash Bros. Ultimate doing on the worst games? I know this is someone else's opinion, I shouldn't be bashing on someone else's opinion, but come on, you really haven't played any of the truly bad games on the list of all times, such as Fallout 76, which apparently is better. You'd rather play Fallout 76 than play Smash Bros. Ultimate and Mario Kart 8, two extremely powerless games that, you know, work completely perfectly compared to one extremely boring and dull experience. I know, but, but they made the DLC for Fallout 76. Well, a game should not have a DLC to be a good game. That's that simple. I don't want to have to buy a DLC for a game that's a pile of garbage. Simple as that. Now we're going for next list. And yeah. This this just gets worse and worse. New Fanboy 88's list of the worst games of all time. Yes. This is another this is one this is the first of the troll lists. I know the top tens does well game with all the troll lists. And yeah. New Fanboy 88, 888, and yeah, this is his list of the worst games of all time. So, Borderlands, the pre-sequel, Earthbound, Dragon Ball Z, Tentaki, Kai Free, Battlefield 4, Super Mario 64, Smash Bros. for 3DS, Ocarina of Time, Team Forces 2, Ice Age Village, and The Last of Us. Most of the games, except for Ice Age Village, are considered great games or at least decent games. This is obviously a troll list. And he likes Superman 64. Yeah, this is a definitely a troll list. Yeah, troll lists. So yeah, it took us a long time to get to an actual bad, an awful 
Trollist. And yeah, we're gonna go find we're gonna see if there's any more Trollists after this one and see if there's even more Trollists out there. So we're going further down, there are not many Trollists, there's not enough Trollists. And then we have the Bidoof Gamers list of worst games of all time. Yes, the Bidoof Gamers worst games of all time. And yeah, this is another, you know, he put a bunch of, you know, creative, creative, creative games. And yeah, and just said they're bad. Doesn't give any reasons why. And yeah, of co- and of course, he downvotes the actual bad games as well. So yeah. Yeah, he, he, he is dumb. He is dumb. Now I'll be going over more lists of really bad lists. Lists. And yeah. Then we have even more lists. Cuphead, I don't I don't really care for Cuphead. But then we have a list of Luigi's Manson on the worst of worst games of all time. I can't agree with Bendy. Bendy sucks. But yeah, Luigi's Manson apparently is the third worst game of all time. Really? Luigi's Manson? You gotta be kidding me. Luigi's Mansion is one of the worst games. I played Luigi's Mansion. It is definitely not one of the worst games of all time. So yeah, you saw your opinion is basically terrible. It's an unpopular, and yes, most of these opinions are unpopular opinions. But yeah, they're pretty bad opinions because ninety nine percent of people are going to disagree with you. And next we have a quote unquote Zelda fan. He has a Zelda character. As a profile pick, but he puts the Zelda as one of the worst games of all time. Uh, probably another very bad troll list that is just absolutely. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. It's a troll list. This is a troll list. And yeah, we'll be going out of here. That's a troll list. And yeah, there we go. We've gone through really bad lists. And this is why the top 10 is just a, such a bad site. There's so many bad and slow lists that make some games so high on the list that it's just absolutely unbelievable. And yeah, there are many troll lists. And yeah, the top 10 is lower poor people for trolling. But you look at Mario 64, worst game of all time. You know, why Mario 64? Why is it worse than Superman 64? For? And yeah, Mario 64, a game that revolutionized Mario 64, a game that revolutionized games, is apparently one of the worst game of all time. You know, and yeah, we have a lot of games that are just risks. And yeah, there's many more risks going down. It can go further down. And there's and here's another one. GTA 5 is apparently the worst game of all time. You know, the game sold 100 million copies. And yeah, this is really bad. Swole lists on the top tens. And that's basically it. Goodbye.